we have to we have to talk about supreme so supreme just dropped their their spring summer 2024 collection it's absolutely smirking absolutely smacking personally and i picked out some of my favorites obviously most of it's available on the store so you can check out yourself if you want to check it out at supreme.com you know where to check it out but the supreme spring 2024 collection is absolutely quite great now i'm not usually a fan of spring um supreme collections i feel like they're, they're probably not the strongest i feel like their winter stuff's always the best because i'm a big jackets guy anyway so i fucking love it but this stuff is good this stuff is good this stuff is really really good um this um cactus plant flea market um designed um varsity jacket in red smacking i'm not somebody that's a big fan of the massive logo especially this box logo fucking design but just you know you've got this amazing um what almost is it like a felt body what is that what's the body um let's see here it's, uh, the, the cowhide leather sleeves feel quilted satin snap well um knit rib coffin and what is it uh shinlin uh chenille um embroidered logo panel on the front and the back uh, like amazing i think that's absolutely beautiful person for me in all red blood red um with this with the supreme logo in and white um cactus plant absolutely smashed on that one so big up her um i really do like this faux fur jacket i know it's not for everybody but the the inner flipping 80s 90s pimp inside of me really 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 wants this i swear to god i absolutely want this i swear to god i absolutely want this looks incredible faux fur in black and white you can't go wrong with that then you got the fishtail parka um, I don't know if most of you guys know, I'm a fucking big fan of a fishtail parka. I love that fishtail parkas are now becoming back in trend again. I've got a um, fishtail parka from the Double Taps. I've got another one from Angland Shop I bought, which is like this little Korean store that does really cool stuff. And what else I've got? I forgot. I've got I've got a few anyway. But one of the ones that I really regret not having anymore was the Supreme Justice for All Fishtail Parker, which I unfortunately lost when I went to Iceland a few years ago. I went to Iceland for some work trip that ended in fucking tears, but I ended up losing my just for fucking my Justice for All Olive Green Supreme Parker, um, Supreme Fishtail, which is absolutely crazy. But now there's another one that's obviously the same sort of colorway, um, a bit different in design. I think standardly you'd imagine, but it's met, but it's done in collaboration collaboration with futura and it's got some futura texting on the back as well um that's what we're banging but i did check the pricing of it lately the other day and it was like 400 pounds i was like god damn it 400 pounds for a fishtail parka now the only reason why it might be a little bit of a good price is because of the lining it does have good it has like a um, an insulated lining on the inside if i'm not mistaken so that's what that's what might make it a little bit more worthwhile but it is quite expensive for a fishtail parka i'm not going to lie um you know 400 something pounds is fucking crazy but you know i guess it's the nature of the beast when it comes to supreme um next on that you've got this amazing gore-tex tape seamed um shell jacket personally for me a lot of people out there aren't fans of this jacket because it's got the kermit the frog um <laughs> signal what you call it illustration here at the back but i quite like this i think there's a really nice little hit on the back a nice playful little hit there to kind of you know soften the blow of you wearing supreme on a daily basis the purple kind of goes crazy too and the red um to be fair you have to give it to supreme like a lot of the stuff they're doing in-house when it comes to the outerwear is starting to fucking eclipse or starting to match um a lot of the stuff that they're doing with collaborators and stuff it's really really cool to see they're not doing as many i guess outerwear collaborations but i honestly feel like a lot of the stuff they do in-house is really good so i really do like that kermit the frog um gore-tex shell um we've also got this amazing um nylon chore jacket in orange that i absolutely love um can't get rid of that um this amazing fleece um this muppets fleece is for me a winner straight up i love this muppet fleece and especially this fucking colorway right it looks absolutely crazy that looks fucking brilliant i love everything about it um we continue here we've got this um brushed argyle zip vest again maybe i wouldn't get too many wears out of this but i just love the look of it in general just to kind of mix up on my wardrobe we've got this maradona soccer jersey which i absolutely love with the maradona mural here on the front like in uh, airbrush mural design look at that that looks absolutely incredible i love this right incredible love this um then you've got um this layered hooded long sleeve top with a t-shirt on top of it as well not mad at that in the slightest 
and then you've got this black cats snapback which i've always been a fan of because unfortunately my head is too big i can't wear supreme camp cats so i have to wear these hats and i feel like these hats are fucking incredible the five panel hats that they make especially some of the trucker hats i think they fit incredibly well so big up supreme for doing that then you got these um a box logo box well box logo new era hats i really do like these and they've got the um they've got the mlb logos on the side so you've got the box logo printed on the, on the front and you've got all these mlb logos right la um i think san fran there new york dodgers i think or detroit Sox, and atlanta i think or something i'm not really too sure i'm not really familiar with some of the mlb teams um you've got this amazing um mesh five panel as well which i really do like especially that logo design that looks really great um and then you've also got the supreme futura new era that looks really cool as well i love the script on that one um then you've also got another box logo um trucker hat which i'm also a big fan of actually that white one with the supreme box logo is absolutely amazing summer season 24 like oh, i would actually wear that to absolute death this beanie the space die beanie is brilliant especially this especially that color at the end unfortunately it sold out because everybody kind of saw the vision that i saw because i think it kind of looks similar to the one of the previous beanies that came out but this particular beanie is absolutely beautiful like supreme makes some really nice beanie so i really do like the look of that then you've got obviously this um gore-tex sunshield hat as well which i've also liked the look of that was absolutely banging um the backpack is absolutely incredible um it absolutely it, it's actually covered in 3m um so when someone shines a light at it, it kind of glows I think the orange color or the camera is probably my favorite, but that orange is, or that orange or red, whatever, I think it's mostly an orange, is fucking smacking, but it, it kind of glows too. That's the kind of, that's the glow when obviously you shine a light on it and the orange then turns into a bit more of a red, but that backpack is absolutely crazy. I love that backpack. Um, I also love this um, duffel, mini duffel bag. It's probably the perfect size for a DJ bag for me, right? You can fit your headphones in there, your USB keys and shit, all your little cables. So I love the look of that. Look at these gloves, right? These Supreme Ducati um, leather gloves, fucking smoking, right? You cannot deny that these Ducati gloves are absolutely crazy as well. They've also got a Ducati bike as a collaboration. Um, you've also got this um, tape seamed um, waterproof, you know, fucking duffel bag that looks absolutely crazy look at that all in white with the big logo there i absolutely love the fucking look of that and it's obviously made in germany as well which is absolutely crazy so love the look of that one you've also got the supreme roland um synthesizer that's absolutely great i'd love to have this just for the just for the fucking fun of it maybe not even to use as a synthesizer i'm not really i'm not gonna lie and then you've also got the rhythm composer i wonder if they're gonna get fucking an artist actually do a really good collaboration with these in terms of the in terms of the flipping promotion pieces i wonder that'd be really cool if they've got like a dj and artist to put, actually put together some cool little bits of primer for this it'll actually be great um and then you've also got look at this you got supreme um five gallon bucket five gallon sorry five gallon back bucket i say bucket well i can't say bucket properly that's gonna look fucking crazy i can't wait to see these getting reselled we're gonna be living in some dark times where we see guys reselling a five gallon supreme bucket <laughs> <laughs> these are gonna go for money what people are gonna be reselling these buckets <laughs> i can't wait to see what's gonna happen you're gonna be reselling supreme bucket i can't wait um then we got some mechanic gloves i absolutely love the mechanic gloves by the way i love the gloves the gloves are fucking banging um they're actually leather um which mechanic don't really do i don't think especially in this type of rate this type of style um you've got the supreme embossed there on the top and um, print all over and you also got the red colorway absolutely great i love the i love the look of these and then you've also got mole skins which are great i'll probably end up getting a couple of these myself and then you've also got these matches which look absolutely incredible and then lastly we have a french press from supreme as well which i absolutely love and probably will try and get myself as well so loads of great stuff in supreme spring 2024 i really do recommend you check it out i really do recommend you check it out and really there's one of my favorite spring collections in a while because again like i said i'm not the biggest fan of supreme spring 2024 collections or spring in general i feel like the winter stuff is definitely better but i'm not mad at it it looks pretty cool i'm not mad at it in the slightest i'm not mad at it in the slightest definitely check it out if you haven't already it looks absolutely smacking 
absolutely smacking. I went to actually double check Supreme. What's happening with Supreme and what is actually sold out from their first drop? Because I think I was kind of skirted over that release of the spring summer 2024 collection. Maybe one of my favorites to date. Um, really cool stuff there. Talking about Cactus Plant, um, this varsity jacket was designed by cactus plant and it's completely sold out which is good to see one of one of the better ones to come out in a while i'm not really a big fan of the big you know crazy logos on the front of supreme you know varsity jackets and stuff but i think the fucking varsity like this is done really fucking well um wool blend with a cowhide leather sleeves feel and quilted satin lining snap front closures it comes in the red it also comes in this nice mustard colorway and the black I'd probably get the red just for the sake of it and it's all sold out 518 as well so that goes to show you that that was definitely a very popular piece that everybody thought was popular i also like the fact that the the fur jacket sold out this is one of my favorites too i love this fucking fur jacket this faux fur jacket is really fucking cool and good to see that it's sold good to see i'm not the only guy that had the same vision faux fur it comes in the brown and the black that looks really cool um completely sold out in all colorways oh look it's got a nice little supreme landing as well oh I love that. It's got this nice supreme embroidery on the inside too. That's fucking beautiful. And a nice chain, um, what you call it, hang tag here so you can obviously not rip. 348 as well, not too bad on the pricing. The only thing I'm a bit disappointed in is the price of this Fishtail Parker. I really want to get this to replace the Just for, Justice for All one that I lost a few years ago. But this Futura Fishtail Parker is 458 pounds. That's way too much for a spring jacket, man spring parker i know it's got luckily it's got a lining in it it's got a little lining on the inside right there as you can see it's got a little lining in there so it's it's kind of substantial there's a bit of a there's like a two for one jacket thing going on there but it's still a lot of money for a fucking parker for spring like it's a lot of fucking pee so not surprised to see this is sitting there the black and the snow camo i'd probably get the olive that's a classic colorway and obviously a text at the back i'll definitely take the hood off straight away no hood on that one we don't need hoods on our fucking fishtails. But that's a pretty nice jacket and I really do like that. Not surprised. What other thing is sold out here? These anoraks are always sold out. These half zips. Kids love these. Same with some of these shiny bits. The shirts always sit for a while. Not surprised. The long sleeve football jerseys always sell out as well. These have become such a cool thing to wear nowadays the kids that that kind of style with the baggy jeans and the timberlands and the football jerseys so i'm not surprised to see this supreme 1999 jersey sold out this um football this football-esque jersey is beautiful this soccer jersey i love the i love that design where it's almost like bleached or faded out in between and you got this blur effect with um the supreme mcm xcvi in the on the bottom there that's fucking nice actually the color in red is probably my favorite that's a really nice colorway with the pink i'm a big fan of that we can scroll down here continue on to see what else is sold out oddly enough are there some of these long sleeves no long sleeves are all there the t-shirts are all there is that vest gone wow yeah the vest is gone so that vest is gone that kind of a jacket vest thing is kind of gone in both colorways the leopard or the zebra print top is still there the hoodies with the football numbers are all gone right the 34 they're all gone the regular plain hoodies with the supreme on the hoodies these are gone the t-shirts are all still there um long this long sleeve oh who actually did this long sleeve design this is really cool i would i'd wear the fuck out of this in pink san sebastian long sleeve shirt is that available in my size here it is i probably might get this one this is really nice all cotton classic supreme long sleeve t-shirt with a printed graphic on the front um the artwork is by an artist called miho kuri kurinagi oh really nice I, I do like the design of this and the, and the graphics on the front that is gorgeous i'm not gonna lie i'll definitely wear the fuck out of that especially in purple or in this pink colorway on my fucking dark black skin oh that look fucking fire i might have to fucking get that actually i'll keep an eye on those long sleeves and definitely get that on payday i'm not gonna lie um if it's still there let's scroll down what else do we have still available what is sold out here t-shirts are all there the pants are still going to be there because people always sleep on the pants i might actually get these white cargos I, i'm not going to lie i do really like these white cargos i know they're a bit crazy for most of you that are watching or listening but there's a pair of white cargo pants they come in camo there's black there's olive right there's some regular colorways here obviously in the cargos you can see there's a red tiger camo but i really want this pair in white I know it's a bit nuts. I know it doesn't make any sense to buy white cargo pants, but where else can you buy nice cargo pants in white like this, you know? Like, 
and it's got a drawstring at the end the hem as well you can snap it on like i might have to buy these and fucking swag these out in an all because I'm, I'm i'm into wearing all white these days as a little feature especially when i go out you know what i mean just to kind of just to kind of jazz jazz it up a bit you feel me just to kind of remind people what what time it is you feel me i think i might have to jump on the all white flex so i do like those white cargo pants um let's continue on and look at some last bits here we got the cargo pants that we like i like the hats hats are all really nice i can't wear any of the camp cats but some of these ones with the boys cool this beanie is fucking banging i'm not surprised it's sold out it kind of reminds me of that other one that released last season with the fraying bits of material the backpack is beautiful i'm not sure some of you guys don't like supreme backpacks but i think this might be one of the better ones they've done in a while um it's covered in a grid pattern that's all 3m so um you know when it obviously light shines on it it's all gonna fucking glow i kind of like it in the orange i'm not gonna lie i think the orange backpack might be my favorite that orange backpack might be my favorite um in the colorways or that or the camo um and then of course you've got it in a smaller bag it's the same design this bag i think the bag here this shoulder bag might be the best one for like a dj bag to fit all my headphones and usbs and shit that might be the one to go forward with it um and then we've also got some scissors here we've got the mechanic gloves which i love um oh this the band is that a bandana the bandana sold out shit okay fair play and then obviously the air force ones in black are always sold out as well so quite a decent first drop to be fair quite a decent first shop lovely lovely stuff there lovely stuff there from the one and only supremo the one and only supremo